Well, hello everyone, and welcome back here to Don't Starve. Hopefully this will be the second episode we're doing this week. And I'm going to keep this going for a while now. And we're going to try aiming for two episodes of this a week for a little while. See how we do. So today, and we're on day four, we are going to get ourselves some wood. Slightly riskier proposal now that it is day four because these trees can become tree guardians now. Oop, lost my axe. And then we're going to head off to the southwest and see if we can find some beefalo. Because that would be good. All the time we're going to be aiming to get ourselves some... Um, aiming to get ourselves... Uh, how are we doing for that? 12, we need another 4 logs. Aiming to get... Uh, where's my shovel? I'm distracting myself. This is not good. Yes, we're going to be aiming to get ourselves... Alchemy Engine, if we can do it. And... Possibly start looking at the other sciencey things as well. Okay, can I? No, I don't have enough flowers to make an umbrella. So I'm just going to have to struggle through this right now. Go away, those are my seeds. Thank you very much. Okay. Love that. Oh, that's it. Right, when you're quite done. For some reason, I can't. No, I didn't want to do that. Okay, we right back. Right, okay, that was a bit weird. Don't know what happened there. But it looks like a restart has fixed the problem. So, you now place the traps. We have sticks and. Well, we have grass tufts. Let's move those out of the way so I don't confuse them. Where's the grass? We don't appear to have any grass. Okay, we need to get grass. And we need to get ourselves oh, some more logs would be good. And I'd also like a pretty parasol if I can make one. Probably I possibly need a science machine for that. So we'll just have to do without. Okay, so we'll grab some resources here on the way through. Yep, we were out of grass. Hopefully we'll see a lot of it down here. But I want to grab all these grass tufts and also all these saplings. We'll pick them up with us. Take them back to base. Well, unfortunately all that confusion has cost me the better part of a day. Which is a bit bad. But we'll make it through. Okay, so we'll take these. I'm not going to take the berry bushes yet because I don't a lot of supply of poop needed to fertilize them. Okay, grab that. And finally this one. Grab that flower on the way past. There we go. Now let's have a quick look over here. Uh, more grassland, more grass. We'll grab that. Doesn't look like there's any beefalo here though. Which is a bit of a disappointment to be honest. Right, that's our shovel gone. Okay, I'll build one for now. Okay, we're done we're done for time, so I think we better head back to base. Uh, 
and we'll plant all that stuff in the morning and then we'll carry on our hunt there's our base there's some fuel in the fire indulge in a bit of bunny slaughter Unfortunately, we're just going to have to cook them as they are. Okay, that will keep us going for a bit during the night, but not that much, to be honest with you. But... Okay, let's start looking at things we need to make. So, in food, I want to make the crock pot drying rack will be good but we don't need it immediately this is the one we want so we've got the sticks and we can make the stone so let's make the stone this one two uh, three okay so now we just need to make the charcoal so we'll set fire to some trees in the morning gosh the, fight, the hobbies I have I don't know so let's just cook this carrot saplings let's plant these down here I do actually say plant so one there one there one there Second, when the sun rises, we'll put one there. There we go. Right. Quickly check our chats. Nothing. Right. So we need six pieces of charcoal now, and to do that, we need to start a fire. Okay. So. Let's start a little bit of a configuration here, shall we? Yeah, that's burning nicely. Let's put that away. Now we just need to wait for these to burn down, like that. Make us a crock pot, and I think we'll also get a drying rack out of this as well. And then what we then need to do is start setting up more traps. We're not having problems. We're having problems getting fruit and veg at the moment, but we, we should be able to get plenty of meat. So that will be our primary food source. And the drying racks are going to be great for that because they will give us jerky. charcoal that's good so let's run back down here to our science engine and that's what we want crop box and that'll be our fire primary cooking device I think Okay, so in there we can chuck the things we find and it will make nice meals for us. Things like this rabbit. And this rabbit. And this rabbit. And looks like we're having a primary rabbity diet here. 
this rabbit. And this rabbit. Okay, so let's put in two, three, and a stick. Give us kebabs. Which will do nicely. Oh, there's some fruit. And a carrot. That's great. There's another meal sorted out. Let's drop that for a sec. Where did that bunny pick that up? And. Bunny murder. There we go. That gives us some space. Okay, and kebabs. So a little bit of food that would have healed us up quite nicely if we've been damaged. Oh, no, no, don't eat it. down here as well. Okay, that's that's out of resources again. Where'd that crap go? They went there. Okay, so we'll pop that there. And that should give us some more yummy rabbit. And these meatballs here are gonna save us. Okay, so how are we doing for food? That's basically our food Sorted out, but we'll make a drying rack as well if we can. Basic farm, fruit farm, bee box, drying rack. Need rope, and for that we need grass. We're out of it. Um, alchemy engine needs dress stone and wood. First of all. case because it's getting late. So, very low on stone again surprisingly so we'll have to go up and get some more of that fairly soon. All right now that should allow us to make an alchemy engine or a thermal measure. I think we'll have an alchemy engine. Gives us lots more things that we can make. Any either of those. I want to make a thermal measure as soon as we can because that gives us great help in working out how. Hmm. Yep. Wait one. Uh, let's pop that. There. That'll stop lightning from hitting the area. That will give us a bit of grass, then we won't have to go hunting for it. Oh, one more tuft. Put that there. There we go. Right, 
So five logs, that obviously is, well actually it's nearly morning, here we go, day six. And, right, let's have a quick look at the map. We started looking down here for beefalo, we didn't find any. We're getting low rocks, so we should actually head up here. I think as we've got plenty of sanity, we shall visit the graveyard as well. And why not? pick some grass up on the way here because we're out. Oh, nearly out. Stay up. Okay, we'll go up here. We've got those meatballs. In fact, I think we're going to eat those meatballs now. There we go. That's filled our hunger almost all the way up. If I had the opportunity, I would make another set of meatballs before leaving. Meatballs, incidentally, is, is pretty much the I don't know what to make out of that recipe recipe. So if he's making meatballs, then... You know, that's the stuff you put in that can't be used for something else. Most other things will give you health or sanity or things like that. Meatballs just fills you up. But to be totally honest with you, at this start of the game, that's pretty much all you want. Okay, I'll have these stones, thank you very much. Uh, where's my pickaxe? Oh, let's make another pickaxe. as well. I feel the thing I should pick up some of these trees on the way up as well. So we're aiming for the more mature ones. Because making some chests would be quite nice at this point. I think we're going to need about 16 logs for that. stone, there's no stone around here, so we might as well just pick it up on the way past, haven't we? What's this over here? Just a rocky area, but ooh. Ooh. Pick up the crank thing. And we now know where a pigment is. Evil flowers, we don't want any of that. Crank thing, as far as I understand, it has no use within itself. But if we find the pig king, it could be traded for gold. Right, this is where we want it to be. Let's make ourselves a shovel and. Up this grave. Yes, excellent. Ooh, angry ghost, angry ghost, run away from angry ghost. Hopefully, he'll get bored. Because I'm not entirely certain what to do with an angry ghost. But we've got gears. Unfortunately, only one set, but those are absolutely essential for making. Uh, where will they be? They be in structure, I think it is. I'll have to get close to the science machine. To make an ice box. An ice boxes will keep our food fresh forever, or at least a long period of time. Uh, We've got stone, we've got flint, we've got lots of things. 
Um, we didn't get any gems. We don't need them just yet. There's gears I'm happy to get. We'll go back to that and do that a bit later. Our sanity is... Well, reasonable, I would say. Oh, I forgot that we were using a shovel. Okay, so let's... Plant this tuft. Like that, okay, and let's... Three pieces of meat. Three pieces of meat and stick we can use for kebabs. I'd rather get a fourth piece. There we go. And go for meatballs. Alright, a bit more money bunny murdering. And let's go and put that in the cockpot. Such a waste though, we need to start getting fruit and veg basically. Go cook that up. Okay, so let's have a quick look at the map. Did we see extra grassland over here? No, we did not. So I think next time what we will do is we will explore this area a bit more. Um, we've got fruit bushes there that will give us some berries. We've got loads of fruit bushes there. So I think it's about time. Actually, what we'll do is we'll go up this way. We'll, we'll hit all these fruit bushes and use that to uh, yeah, make the bunnies last a little bit longer. There you go, there's our meatballs. Excellent. Oh uh, yeah, that'll fill us up. That'll keep us going for a little while. And that's a lot. Okay, well that's the end of day six. That's three days. I think that's probably good for the episode. So I shall see you all later. Until then, I've been Simon Parsons. This has been Don't Starve. Thank you and good night.